Hey everyone! Today I'm going to show you the new features Google released in Google Drive the other week. We've all been down that rabbit hole when we go searching for a document in Google Drive. Google has added two new buttons to help us locate our files easier. I'm on my drive right now and I'm going to show you these two new buttons. These buttons will appear when you're in Shared With Me, Recent, or Starred Views here on the left hand side of your screen. So let's select the view Shared With Me. When I select a document in this view, say Guru Daily Newsletter here, you'll see this bar appear with the new buttons. One of the new buttons is this button here called Add to My Drive. Now this appears here because the document I selected is not yet stored on my drive. Now I have the option to add it straight to my drive. And when you click it, the icon as you can see has changed to Move To. So now, after clicking it once, I can click the Move To button, and from here, I have a drop-down menu of choices of where I can move this document to. So let's try that again with another document that's not in my drive yet. Okay, so I know this isn't stored in my drive yet because this button's still here. So when I'm ready to add it to my drive, I'll click this and watch it change to the other new button available today. Now I have the Move To option and the drop down menu appears again so I can choose to add to a different view I can choose to add to a different folder so this move to button is also available in other views such as starred like you can see here these are already documents stored on my Google Drive and therefore I don't have the add to my Google Drive button available but it defaults to move to You'll also see Add to Drive and Move to buttons available in the preview of a document. So let's select another document in my Shared with Me view here and we'll click the Preview button where we also have the new buttons available, Add to My Drive that turns to Move to and where I can file away in my Google Drive. Hope this video gives you a brief demonstration of where to find these new buttons and how to use them. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time.